on Target. Me did that with. You got this camera at Target? Yeah. <laughs> Where do you come up with this stuff? Let's talk about that shirt for a second. Yeah. Who's it from? Carly Jean. Classic. Every pair of clothing's from Carly Jean. Blueberry muffins. Homemade banana bread. I think so. Dad, I'm oh, you're changing? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Let me know when you're done. Good morning. How's it going? Daddy, how you doing? Yeah, how you doing? Hey, Man, I wish all I wish my hair looked like that in the morning. You want to hold it? Say hi vlog. Hi vlog. Hi vlog. Shaka. There. Look at you can look at the screen. Say hi Azzy. Hi. Hey bud. Azzy. Hey bud. Hey. Good morning. How are you doing? How are you doing? Good morning. You ready to go get some breakfast? Oh yeah, to fill up the belly? <laughs> As he's excited, look at that guy. Look who I got! Hey! Good morning! Good morning, Good morning! Good morning. I hold that to <laughs> Guys, he's always, he, he has to be set down immediately to eat. He's always the first. To eat. And this girl loves her bloobs. Are you sniffing them? How do they smell? <laughs> Mama Bear. I want to get one that say Daddy Bear and Sissy Bear and Reggie Bear. We need, we need all the bears! I don't know if anybody knows where to find those. Uh, I know I get a Buggy Bear Beat Poo too. You want to get a <laughs> You want to get one that says Brushy Bear for your stuffed animal Winnie the Pooh? That's a good idea. Yeah, he's so little. He's so little. Guys, we're a dairy-free household because of this girl right here. So public service announcement, these two milks will change your life. This one is super rich and like expensive. It's meant for coffee. It's meant for coffee, like kind of, you know, a little like to mix it in drinks. But this one, I mean, it's also a little expensive, but insane. Yeah, so we usually get the milk, the one at Target is always the green one that's unsweet. Mm -hmm. And another one too. And, and the, the yellow one. The yellow, and my mom accidentally got us this one the other day. And it was amazing. It Amazing. And amazing. so I try to save this one especially for a cannon because I feel like it's a lot creamier So I feel like it's more like a whole milk. She has to ration me. She she puts me on probation. Only cannon can have it I'm not allowed to. Also another public service announcement If you ever make banana bread put a little bit of butter a little bit of cinnamon on it and then put it in the broiler. Boom! Amazing. And our favorite Banana bread recipe is Joanna Gaines's because yes. Jeff doesn't like banana bread. It's like yeah. not mushy. This one's almost huh? like a cake. So <laughs> She's a huh? go, Joe. Basically, ninety percent of people's banana like bread me. tastes I like it wasn't even cooked all, all the way. It's mushy and wet, and Which it's is what I like. I'm just but like, what's going on here? Good. But this one is more like a cake. It's amazing. You're building. Who gets to build with you? Daddy does? Do you want to say anything to the cam cam? No, I, I put that here. Tell me when you want to no, go no, no, make a speech. What's his name, Rufus? No, I hold that. Hold on, is his name Rufus? No, I hold that. What's his name? <laughs> Rufus, his house. Oh. Huh, who's this guy right here? Hey, Raj. Oh! What's so funny, buddy? Where'd you get this camera? It's a, uh, a Target. Me did that with. You got this camera at Target? Yeah. <laughs> Where do you come up with this stuff? And you have the tripod too. <laughs> Whose name? Daddy. The guy on the other side of the vlog? Yeah. Um, I think it's Rufus. <laughs> also, it's like about, it's pretty much lunchtime, but she uh, wanted to put on her new PJs just because she thinks they're comfy, so they got put on. 
<laughs> How you doing, babe? Pretty good. Tell the people what you did today. I cooked. For an army. Morning. Give all the deets. How many meals did you cook this morning? Three. Only two. No, three plus cookies plus banana bread yesterday plus Not muffins right. this morning. Cray! It's like you're superwoman. No, I'm not. Guys, she's trying to be modest, but she's just babe salad's servant for days. She basically cooks some meals for some friends, for us to give away. All these different things. She's incredible. How many, how many do you <laughs> Can you say happy Shabbat? <laughs> Today's not Shabbat, but every week we start, we celebrate Shabbat, and literally we said it the other day at, at the table during dinner, and he said it too. What's up, guys? So we just put the kids down for nap, and uh, that usually means it's time for me to go to work a little bit. Everything's calm, everything's chill. Uh, there's not a peep in the house, so then I can kind of just get some things done a lot faster. Um, and I want to say a couple quick things. First of all, um, I realized today we kind of didn't do much for the vlog. We just kind of chilled and hung out at home, and I realized that's kind of the point. You guys want to get a day into the life of us, and that's what we want to show, and, I, and some days, and a lot of days, we just kind of hang out. We play with the kids, we chill, and then at nap time, I work, and then uh, we wake up and play some more, eat dinner, hang out with the kids, read books, put them down to bed, me and Alyssa get connect time, and then I work a little bit more. So it's a little bit more uh, non-traditional schedule, but it's one we love. Also, huge news, we're bringing two things back today. Now, the first one is the vlog, which is what you're watching, so I don't need to announce any more of that. The second thing is the podcast drops again today. Yes, that's the thing you guys have been hitting me up for years about. Bring it back, bring it back, bring it back. We finally did, and I'm super stoked. And so real quick, I want to give you a preview. It takes a lot of faith and a lot of patience, which we're not good at in the day and age of Amazon Prime. It's um, true, it's true. <laughs> especially if you live in Seattle and it's like <laughs> an hour away from you. But And it can also seem like, you know, mm. I'm supposed to wait on the Lord, but what can I actually do to wait on the Lord? It yeah. just seems like a passive thing. I don't know how to learn the things that my dad is supposed to teach me. Like how do you get a job or buy a house? Or how do you figure it out where to go to college? I don't know what happens when people get in divorce. On TV, divorced people are crying a lot, so I'm really afraid of it. But I don't really know what it even means. Now what you just heard right there is two shows, so we wanted to bring it back. Um, and so that you would be familiar for those of who had listened to it before, but also do something new and so something fresh. So we basically, it's one podcast, one name, Love the Last Podcast with Jeff and Alyssa, link down there in the description if you want to listen, but we kind of are going to alternate weeks and do kind of um, a mini series, if you call it. So on the, the, the odd weeks, the first week, it'll be just like what it was before, me and Alyssa at the coffee table, hanging out, chatting, talking about life. Then every other week, the even weeks, alternating off of that, um, it's actually going to be a deep dive, deep dive on what makes relationships succeed or fail. It's going to feel very much more like investigative journalism. If you listen to NPR, it's going to sound like that. I'm super, super stoked for that. Um, we're going to alternate those every single week. So listen down in the description. Let me know what you think. All right, so got some work done during nap time, and the kids are officially up, which means not getting any more work done. <laughs> you slept good? No, I had that. Well, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to hold it just for a second, okay? I like your shirt, though. Where'd you get that one? Hey, look, is that you? Is that you right here? Hi. Hi. <laughs> I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna chase you. The favorite part, he runs. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. This is the best part, you guys, about our house. Our downstairs being one big circle. We can just run laps. Oh, oh. Back where we started. I'm gonna get you. <laughs> okay, I think you win. So we just finished dinner. Sorry, no footage of that. We got a, no screens, no technology policy at the dinner table. Oh, you want my big camera? Yeah, you big one, I use that one. Oh, you want me to get my big one so you can use this one? Yeah. What I was gonna say is the kids are all uh, taking baths. You know, what, what take baths. Okay. <laughs> she said the little kids are taking baths. Um, but yeah, brother's taking a bath. It's usually right after dinner we do that, and then I'm the one that does clean up. So what about you? If you're married, what, what's kind of your guys' little roles there in the sense of uh, how you guys break up the responsibilities? Huh? <laughs> Hi Rufus. She thinks everyone who watches the vlog is named Rufus. So shout out to Rufus's out there. <laughs> um, but yeah, I do dishes and I clean and uh, Alyssa does the baths and then we put them to bed. So yeah, fun night. Wow. Mickey, you are getting the dipe job of the century, brah. Do you love taking care of your babies? Yeah. Yeah. Why do you like taking care of them so much? You just have such a tender heart. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, you're gonna get a diaper ready for Brudgy? Can you use this one? I use mine. Whoa. Can I get mine? 
Hey sis, what you guys doing? Are you guys eating snacks? Oh, look at that! Look at that! Oh, Brudgy, that is so kind. That is so kind. Guys, we got this bread maker lately, and Alyssa's been on a bread kick. Can you say carbs for days? I zoomed in on you. <laughs> it's time to assess today. Do you think today was, was today a good day? No. It wasn't a good day, why not? I took pictures today. I think you meant yes, it was a good day, because you took pictures today. What else did you do? I you, you took care of your baby? No, I have a baby here. Oh, you're a baby right now? Yeah, she's in her zippity. Do you want to tell Rufus anything? No, yeah, you can have Rufus. <laughs> what about you, buddy? You got anything to say? Rufus? For me? Cheers, Brush. Cheers. Cheers. Ah, psh, cheers. <laughs> so sweet. How you feeling? I'm really tired today. Guys, you know those days where you're just tired? It's one of those days. And as you'll yeah. see in the vlog, all we did was hang around the house. Now, I don't think that's why we're tired. I think we hung around the house because we were tired before that. <laughs> <laughs> Parents, can I get a shout out? Amen. Um, we're excited the vlog's back. We just want to do uh, uh, end the vlog today, letting you guys know we're stoked it's back. And let us know in the comments ideas and suggestions you have for it. I kind of want to step it up a little and do some fun like segments in the vlog. One I thought would be fun is Alyssa's like... Uh, recipe sensei, so I thought it'd be really and, uh, you are I and, just enjoy cooking. Yeah, and since we'll be doing it once a week I thought it'd be fun to do like you know where she picks one thing she makes that day And then we put the recipe in the description or on video or whatever So let me know if you think that's a good suggestion anything else any fun ideas you got what we're gonna do like a uh, sharing time Oh, yeah, and then I thought it'd be cool because we just believe in family so much from a theological perspective like we, we try to be so intentional and have visions and uh, be intentional about what we do as a family, why we do what we do as a family. So that'd be fun to kind of pull apart one theme per week uh, and talk about that. So let us know in the comments again if that's something you're interested in. Um, yeah, anything you got to say? Nope. Is there anything you want to say? Uh, nope. That means we're signing off, folks. We love you. It means we're <laughs> going to go watch Heart of Dixie. Heart of Dixie, Alyssa's favorite show. It's like five years old, but it's like the best. I Love it. It's the only show I've ever been able to watch a second time around. Yeah, she watched it the whole three, four seasons on Netflix, and then she started watching all of it again. And it's just, <laughs> it's even better the second time, because I, I know what's going to happen. Are you Team Wade or Team George? I was Team George back in the day. I'm Team Wade now. No, you were kind of 50-50. That's true, but I like Team Wade now. Now you're Team yeah. Wade. Why do you like Team Wade now? He's just a legend. Well, tell the people. Tell Rufus. Tell Rufus! <laughs> <laughs> Let's have this conversation. This is so... Soul filling for everyone out there. Basically, Wade is one of those guys that he, uh, Zoe makes him a better man, and that's what I like. Or at least brings out the betterness in him, and that's what I like about him. So you're a Wade fan now. Yeah. So if you've seen it, you know what we're talking about. If you haven't, you gotta go check it out. But that's all we got. Hey, love you guys. Talk to you next week.